So yeah, welcome to uh, the stream. Today I'm gonna be playing Ultimate NES Remix. Now, this is something that has been sitting in my backlog for a very long time. Uh, the story behind me getting this game is pretty much... I got a 3DS, uh, I got a few games for it, and then the, uh, the Switch was announced. So yeah, that was, uh, that was something. So, I, I never got to play this properly. <laughs> but here we are, you know, I don't know, like, almost ten years later. Okay, hang on. Let me just double check the audio. I think it's fine. Yeah. Anyway, let's get to it. Uh, if you're watching this later, of course, thanks for clicking, as always. I should probably erase the save data on it, hang on. Because I think there's save data here, so hold up. I probably should have looked at this beforehand. Okay, hang on. Ultimate. Nez Remix Erase Data. Some of the stuff they never documented, it's kind of like this hidden thing. Erase. And this is the case with this. Hang on. Deleting data, okay. Oh, this is like a... Okay, hold up. This is, uh... As the software is launching, I gotta hold, like, a button combination, so hang on. It's like this. There we go. Yeah, that's, a uh, that's a little strange, but sure. <laughs> Aren't I organized as always? Alright. Shit, I dropped my stylus. <laughs> okay. Uh, I mean, sure, it's like... I'm gonna say use, but it's, it's never gonna be a thing. Okay. Defeat 15 enemies before... Oh, right. Oh, no, I see, okay. I mean, this is- this was conceptually cool, because it felt like it was in the same vein as uh, WarioWare, where it was just like a bunch of little experiences. <laughs> and you kind of just go in and out of them, so... Why not? It's a good way to chill, I think, this weekend. Donkey Kong? I was never any good at Donkey Kong. <laughs> Alright. Excite Bike, I like Excite Bike. I didn't own that game, but there was a friend of mine that had it, and I have a lot of memories from it. This is something that I can kind of play what I want. Um, I guess I have to do some of the other ones, so... Jump over three barrels. Oh, crap. See, I was never good at- I was never good at Donkey Kong. Okay. 
forgot this. <laughs> I, I should have just waited. It's pretty easy. Go to the goal. Some of these are almost just like tutorial. Walk over the bolt to remove it. Oh, it's a sabotage. I mean, it makes me feel good about the fact that I was doing kind of average. Parasol, let's see. Oh. What? And I gotta jump. There's two ways to do it. Collect the bag. Oh no, that, that doesn't work. Okay. I went up the stupid way. There we go. <laughs> Jeez. Not much of a window to get it. Okay. What? Oh, you're not allowed to touch the ground here? No, but I can't go that way. No. Two barrels at once? I'm guessing that would be like two different laps. The slope allows that. Three! Jeez. This is a good game to kind of give to someone that wants to play retro games but isn't quite good at them. This is like isolated little things to do to make you better at it. Get 3,000 points. Okay. Jeez. 
ค่ะOh, you're not allowed to fall. Okay, I have to wipe this out. I mean, I can do that, but other than that... I think for the sake the achievements is probably not a good s ah, spot to stand. Excite bike. I feel like doing Excite bike. Oh man, I haven't played this in a very long time. I thought this game was really cool looking because it kind of had the pseudo 3D effect. You just have to watch the temperature of your bike as well. Oh! I failed. I apparently cleared despite crashing into something. Oops. No, do I really have to... Do I have to really... Do it the whole way through? Like, maybe I can just get away with doing it at the end. Jeez. 
That's uh that's a brutal one. Maybe I'm missing the point. Maybe I just do the wheelie at the right time. Yeah, okay. It seems like that's the case. What is this? <laughs> what is this? I got it. Let's get over him. Okay, I understand it now. One star. Oof, I did terrible. What? Okay, there we go. <laughs> Another one. Haha. <laughs> Still probably ranked poorly. Nope, okay. I wonder why I did so bad on the other one. Anyway. Use turbo to and speed to the finish line. Keep doing excite bike. a lap track one. All right. I'm 
I mean, I guess I am trying to go for a good time. Knock your rival with your back wheel. Ha! <laughs> okay. Knock five rival bikers. I don't remember being able to do... They did it to themselves, does that count? Crap! Oh. <laughs> yes. Oh, yes, loophole. <laughs> Just start a pile up. I mean, it didn't say anything about winning the race, so it's just. Just set to cause carnage, that's it. Finish the l get to the finish line without crashing. Oh. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh. This is actually kind of tense. No! Oh, you dick! <laughs> I should have seen that coming. Oh, these other cyclists. That was a ballsy move on my behalf. <laughs> yeah, no, that's, that's great. That one was tricky. And of course, one star, because that was horrible. Beat the third best time. Okay, so there's, there's no restriction here, it's just do good. Do good! These are the bikes.
I'm not sure I'm gonna make this. Ah. Not nah, too many crashes. This is it's gonna be a Christmas miracle if I make it. Oh, no, nah, I got it. I thought I was doing horribly though. An entire lap without crashing. I'm gonna be here a while. I guess as long as I stick to my lane. I didn't stick the landing. Why? <laughs> that I need I need to adjust myself. How do I keep stacking it there? <laughs> I think I'm not going quick enough. If it tries to make me do a whole race without crashing, that's that's like impossible. There's no way. All I remember in this game is that you crash. <laughs> that's basically it. Side bike used to play this game so much. Oh, yeah, me too. I, I had a neighbor that I used to go over to, and we'd just jam this. It's great. I have to try and complete a whole lap without crashing. I'm slowing right, right down. Like, the objective is to just finish the lap without crashing. It doesn't say anything about doing well. Okay. <laughs> there it is. challenge what is it beat the lap time beat the best time Ugh, all right 116 is what we're going for but i guess we're solo so i guess that's nice this game was so cool like i had a track designer as well okay yep i see i see the error of my ways this is that hill right there, I have to slow down. Oh. 
I'm not gonna get it. This is just lap one. I did it again! Ah! <laughs> Stupid hill. No, I already failed. How much did I fail by? Five, four seconds, okay. No, three seconds. Oh, you can restart. Cool. Yeah, let's do that. <laughs> it's not gonna work. Okay. I got this. Oh! I landed it! There is hope! What a, what a lap. Did I just land it again? I landed it again! Let's go! <laughs> Smashed it! I'm enjoying this so far. <laughs> it's just... The nostalgia value is pretty much it. Okay. What do we want to do next? Let's do another remix stage. Run, Mario, get to the goal pole. All right. Mario 1. Mario 1 is like no stress whatsoever for me. I would not accept anything less than that. <laughs> oh, I, I skipped a, a few. Dr. Mario. Eliminate the moving virus. Okay. I haven't really played Dr. Mario. Do you just trap it and then... Oh, it doesn't... I don't, I don't know how this works. How, how does this work? I don't know how Dr. Mario works, I've never played it before. Okay, whatever, now we just need blue. No, wait, did it work? What do you mean? Pass to be four in a row, okay. Give me a blue piece, give me a blue piece! Blue piece! Blue piece! <laughs> That's color stacking, I wasn't aware it was four in a row though. 
Can I trap it? Oh no, I, I've, I've beamed this up. Oh, got it. <laughs> okay. It's an interesting puzzle game. There are some of these NES games that I've never played before, so it's going to be interesting. Get to the goal? What is this? Oh! Oh no! This is such a cool idea, just like... Little things like this to kind of breathe new life into these older games. Oh no! Oh. Wouldn't climb the ladder. Okay. I probably could have done that quicker. <laughs> Collect all the coins. Yo, it's Kirby! <laughs> oh, this is cool. These stages are pretty original, I gotta admit. I'm having a lot more fun than I thought I would. Okay, so I've done that. Defeat Wispy Woods. Wait, what is- what is- Oh, 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 oh no. I haven't played OG Kirby though. This is distracting! <laughs> I'm not gonna win. Ah! Okay, hang on. Just gotta be good. stage. Uh, what game do I feel like? You know what? Metal. Let's do some Mario 3. Some of these are just tutorials. Even if that's the case, it's still injecting nostalgia directly into my veins. Oh, GK Boo is a lot of fun too. I need to play it at some point. The, the first one that I played was um, the Game Boy one. 
That was my introduction to Kirby. The fate, the fate three Goombas. Mini Goombas. Oh, oh, that's what they are? Giant Goombas. Hit the pay switch and collect coins. <laughs> okay. Enter the pipe. Okay, this one was always a tricky one. Oh, come on. Alright, that's fine. Because I took out a block. But doing that perfect was always tricky. Oh, coin boy! You know what's crazy about this? I mean, one, the unlock method, but like... The number of little secrets this game had. There was one that I only learned of recently, and I had no idea it was a thing. But apparently in World 1, there's a way to get a special mushroom house. One that's kind of hidden on the map. I had no idea this was a thing. And I saw a streamer do it and talk about it like as if it was common knowledge, and I was like, what? What do you mean? <laughs> Kinda blew my mind a little. Punch-Out, that is a game I have never played. But I've heard so many people talk about that one. I guess I can't call it Mike Tyson's punch out. This was one of my favorite, um, power-ups in the Mario game. I don't know, I just found the shoe just so much fun. And it just felt rewarding to be able to hold on to it as long as possible. You used to know all kinds of Mario secrets that you've forgotten over the years. Was that one of them, though? Like, that one, I think the conditions for it are, are super specific. Punch Out was a challenge, you had the Mike Tyson version. I, th I think that's what they had in America, and then everywhere else it was just Punch Out. Primarily, anyway. Give mushroom, please. Thank you. I've been always meaning to get around to this game, but like... I kind of checked it out for a little bit and then left it because, you know, the Switch. But, no, well, this makes a good... A good stream, I think. 
because it's self-contained and I can do as much of it as I want, and it definitely gets that nostalgia value. Yeah, some of them were based on your score, or the, a certain digit in your score, and then others it was based on, like, the clear time. Boom, boom. Hmm. I see some interesting thumbnails here. Play to get to the top. Oh, this is the... yeah, this... I really liked this stage. Of course, it was in my least favorite world. <laughs> This. You're as a frog, right? Yeah. I always saw the frog suit as just a uh, a challenge. Like never a serious way to play it, but more of a like if you want to challenge yourself type. Do you, uh, what? I didn't know you could do that. Oh, oh no, no, they, they're not kidding. <laughs> you have to win this frog. Oh, that was lucky. But like, realistically, you would not get up to this point in the frog suit. I'm sorry. I mean, you could, it's just, it's not easy. Oh, I thought I could skip. It's okay. <laughs> Defeat 15 enemies as fire mayoral. Okay. I mean, doesn't say with fireballs, but I'm just gonna assume that that is the case. I see some interesting stuff in the thumbnails, but we won't get to it. Oh, it's ice, ice world. Okay, I have, I have this. <laughs> oh, that was weird. That was really weird. <laughs> I was standing on it. But, um... 
What? It, it didn't register that I was standing on that? Like, that was weird. Oh no, it did fish. Get an item from the question mark block. I used to love trying to bounce between these <laughs> back and forth. It was just something to do while the auto scrolling! No, what do you mean? Ah, I didn't get the item. I got sniped at the last possible second. Into the pipe, all right. Shit. <laughs> I can't believe it just fell. That should be it. Just into the pipe as soon as possible. At least I'm good at that. <laughs> Zelda! Ooh. I might do that one next. There's still more Mayor, though. Oh yeah, this stage was fun. This was one of my favorite stages. It's set... Um, yeah, it's being weird. It's being weird. It's not registering my down slide input, so... Oh no, yeah, no, this is, this is jank. This is just straight up just do the stage. 
I think it's it's just the 3DS D-pad. It's it's not great. So I don't feel like I'm in my element right now. Yeah, to be honest, I'm better off being tiny. <laughs> it's dangerous to go alone. I'm kind of curious, because I think... I wonder if this is going to be like a really good tutorial for Zelda 1. Because that game, man, just, there's no hand-holding in that one. Defeated Rocky Wrench. Oh, yes, walk into the cannonball. Oh, yes. No. Nah. <laughs> Ooh. This is more of a, a survival thing as opposed to defeating the enemy. I just honestly just want to be at the edge of the screen. What do you mean? What do you mean? Oh no, this is like a... Uh... What? No, I beat him! That was mutually assured destruction. <laughs> Alright, I mean, I'm still, I'm still doing well at it, it's just... Defeat Boom Boom? Okay. But this is Flying Boom Boom, most likely. It's gonna go through all the variants. This is just basic, right? I never found Boom Boom a threat, ever. Okay, this one might be harder, admittedly, because it's ice. But still, it was just like, just do that. This has to be Flying Boom Boom. Just chain it. <laughs> oh, it's the Bowser fight, yo. At... As Frog Mario. What? Oh my god, I love this music too. Oh, this is gonna be hard. This is already hard enough. Without having to retain the frog suit. That was pretty quick, it was on the third, third jump, so... It's about as quick as you can do it.
I mean, not bad. Alright, I'll do punch out. Because I've never played it. Let's see. Press up, A, or up, B. Okay. Press A or B to learn body blows. Okay. I assume this is like tutorial. <laughs> Rarely press A or B to get back up. Dodging at the wrong time. Okay. Ah. I didn't get a knockout. Okay. Try again. Okay. <laughs> there we go. Yeah, I expected as much. I kind of expected as much. Alternate up A and up B to knock out Von Kaiser. Ooh, you need to be quick, huh? Am I doing it wrong? Nearly had it. 
This is hard, man. <laughs> Too early. It literally leaves me A, B, A, B, repeat. But you have to hold up, though. But that's what I'm doing, it's just it doesn't seem to be quick enough. Maybe I just need to go all in, I don't know. I keep trying to dodge it. It doesn't seem like there's enough time. <laughs> do I need to just do it faster? Let's see, he dodges at a certain point and then... Definitely one of these, like, easy to play, difficult to master type games. Ah, oh, thank you. Oh man. <laughs> Avoid his blows and then uppercut. But yeah, these are all gonna be one stars. <laughs> I am resigned to my fate here on this one. Get a KO or TK before the round. Okay. Yeah! Oh, yes! Get it over and over again. Eh, what is this? <laughs> Whatever. Oh, it's not over yet. Am I? Ah. Okay. <laughs> I'm just too impatient to play this.
Oh, really? Technical knockout. Come on, let's go. Really? Already, already one down. Okay, two. One star this time. Uh, <laughs> Land three punches while avoiding Piston Hondo's attacks. Time your punch with the enemy's advance. What? There we go. I mean, this would serve as a good tutorial. For sure, like... I think if you wanted to teach someone to play this game, this is this is the way to do it. Because it's isolated little ways to know how to play it. Press Y to uppercut Don Flamenco to the ground. <laughs> okay. Hippo King's open mouth. Okay. So I guess this is a full fight now. Oh, 
Yeah, I'm just practicing here. I'm not going to get it this first time. This is gonna be a hard one. gonna restart it. This is not going well. You know, this guy's the best to block or is it best to sidestep? Watch the- wait, what? Just watch? What? <laughs> what am I looking at here? Why was that in there? Okay, so that was punch out. Let's do Zelda. Alrighty for the nostalgia here. It happens at set intervals, but I didn't need to do anything, right? It's like an old boxing moving trading montage. No, I mean... Why, though? I didn't have to do anything. <laughs> like, I understand what it is. Yeah, so this is tutorial Zelda right here. Get the key. Let's stab the mummy, yeah. Or the skeleton. Just a certain nostalgia? Yeah, I guess. I'm 
man. There's something about this music. I'm doing quite a bit lengthy snipe, so... That was a bit poor. Oh, that was where the code sequences showed up? Okay. Got it. Get rupees. Oh, but like... Okay. Is this RNG or is this scripted? I wonder if you could go explore the whole map with this. I mean, is this really the whole thing in here? I'm kind of curious. So we are going by the RNG of the game here. <laughs> nice. I was expecting that one to come up. It would have to. I mean, there's a lot here. Maybe we'll do a second part of this. I am enjoying it. Open the door. But see, the thing was, you wouldn't know that that was there, really. This is just kind of teaching you, oh, this is a thing. Doesn't matter, I don't have to not take damage. Do it quick. Alright, time to fight the dragon. It seems I have more health than I should for this point in time. Well, I guess to, maybe not necessarily, because you can do other dungeons before you even come to dungeon one. Defeat all enemies without taking damage. Oh, I got the bow and arrow. I got 20 shots. Just do it for quick. Nice. Bombs? <laughs> I would never do this. This is just like on, on the side of it being a challenge. I mean, if you're doing a swordless challenge, I guess this is what you have to resort to.
Find the hidden entrance and go in. Well, we didn't really find that. Like, it, it was already discovered for me. Wait, there's a hidden entrance here? Oh, it should be here. What was this one? Oh, it's a secret to everyone. Alright, but this one is... Yeah. Again, it's already shown me. Is it this one? Yep. It's a good thing I remember some of these. <laughs> This is only, uh, the beginning of this. There's still so much to do. Defeat the Dongo! I only- I can't miss here. We'll do remix stages after this, since we've unlocked quite a few. Oh, there's 17 Zelda stages, jeez. Oh no, it's another. Yeah, this is gonna be annoying. Lucky! <laughs> Okay, the, the thing has been disabled. Find the real one and defeat it. <laughs> that was a pot shot. Alright. I got lucky with that one. Twice. Another Dodongo, without taking damage this time. No, it's just... We don't need to pick up the heart. Oh, it's revealing where the sword is. And the fact that you need seven hearts for it. But I always used to call this the Master Sword, even though it's, I guess it's not. Oh, it still has the classic NES slowdown. Smack bang right in the middle. But see, this, this is only because I know this. If you didn't know that, man. Oh, it gives you a potion? We don't need no... Oh, no, no, we might need a potion, actually. I just realized. Why is it hitting so hard? Holy crap, why is it hitting so hard? I was like, no, we don't need no potion. Yes, we do. Evidently, that was just... I don't know if that was changed. I guess because we had the standard armor. Maybe that would be why. Hmm. 
Ooh, Balloon Fight. That's a fun game. Keep going with Zold. Defeat enemies without taking damage. Lego last time. Oh. Damn bat. <sighs> Maybe the bomb is the right way to go on this one. Okay. See that I didn't know. But if you kill them with bombs, they don't divide. So there's something I've learned. There's a couple of ways to do this. I can hope for the RNG, or I can just go to a specific spot. Which I think we're nearby. It's this D-pad, I'm just not used to it. <laughs> yeah, it's here. Secret shop, buy the armor. Or the ring, I guess. Wait, wasn't it that one? Which one was it? That one. Ooh, this music, man. Boo, I don't have any other weapons. I was saying, no, come on, I should have a full, full inventory. I should be allowed to access the arsenal that I have gained at this point. It's these things that are annoying, the curse things. I... I know, you want to talk about obnoxious rooms. There you go. It's showing you where it is, but that's all well and good. Just navigating to that room is tricky. Boss fight. Ooh. 
That's what irritating. Oh, this one's just as bad as well. gonna end with me just shooting a silver arrow into Ganon. But see, you wouldn't enter the final dungeon without having this. These, these hints were so cryptic though. Go up, up, the mountain ahead. Classic Dark Knight fight. It is removing the mystery of <laughs> some of this. Find the way to the boss's lair. I wonder if you could get this wrong. Don't fight the boss. Okay, I guess it doesn't... Oh, it never would have occurred to me to use that. Okay. I always just used to use a sword for that. I wonder if it did more damage. Interesting. Also, that castle took me like a decade to find, so... <laughs> you know. Oh, the story of me and Castle 7. I found it by mistake years after the fact. 
I just, I never finished this game as a kid because I couldn't find Castle 7 ever. And then one day I found that by accident and finished the game. <laughs> one of them. Nice. Maybe this might end with murdering Ganon. Yeah, it would appear so. Thanks, Link. You're the real. Well, you're the hero. I was gonna say you're the real MVP. <laughs> Kid Icarus. Oh man, that game is hard. This has a lot more content than I thought it would. Oh, and when it's done, the TV goes golden. Wait, why is the TV golden here? Oh, because I three-starred everything, okay. Alright, let's continue the remix stages. Yeah, I only played it a couple times, but Kid Icarus was hard. Alright, get to the goalpost. Whoa, okay. That is, um, an interesting take on it. Ugh. D-pad. This should be trivial. Ignore the clones and get to the goal? Ignore the clones? What is this? Oh no, I hate this. I hate this already. Oh, okay. <laughs> ah, damn it. It's so distracting. <laughs> Thank you. 
You know, this would be pretty cool if you could get working for, um, like, crowd control! This is like training for crowd control. Just... Dude, this is so distracting, it's so funny. It's throwing me off. Because I keep thinking I have to keep all of them safe, but it's it's not the case of that at all. It's... Oh. Like, you just have to work with the middle one. I don't think I could get through the entirety of this game like that. Okay, jeez. Open a- oh, this is- I just played this. This was in- this was in Curb. The one that I'm playing now. Kinda cool to see this in its original form. Oh, this is not easy. That one really seems to throw me off. Yeah! It's okay. Enter the pipe without taking damage. Wait, what? Oh! What on earth? It's Mario 2, Peach, Toadstool, I should say, but in Mario 3. Oh, this is so weird. I'm throwing off. The thing is, I don't know her mechanics, like how far you can fly with her. Oh, Alright, maybe I should stop... Stop being greedy and just get it done. How does she work? Okay, just hold it. You just hold it. Alright, got it. Really? <laughs> I got sniped at the very end. Oh no. Oh, it, it is is a hard liability to run too fast with her. You love the Kirby mini games. The cannon jewels were fun. Kirby has some great mini games. Like I was saying this the other night, but I'm kind of surprised it hasn't been like a, a Mario Party game. But I mean Kirby Party, you know, like in the style of Mario Party, but just Kirby mini games. I mean, maybe there has been, and I'm not aware of it, but, like, with online play, I guess, is the other part I was going to add. Ah! Because <laughs> you know how great Nintendo is at, uh, online games, right? Like, they make them all the time, and they are perfect experiences.
Okay. No! <laughs> this one should not be throwing me off this much. It's just because this this is so foreign and I'm trying to be greedy with it, but... Like, I have the mentality that, oh, I've been playing Mario 3 for ages, I can be- I can- I can be greedy with this. You could probably keep the momentum up. Don't you dare! Uh, okay. Worth it. Oh, this is Excite Bike, but like... Nighttime Bike. Pretty cool. Enjoying these remix stages. Enter the pipe on a speeding airship. Oh no. I think what would be cool is if they made this game without having the need to play the retro ones, you know, like. Just have this, but kind of like a WarioWare style where. This would be so good if this was a WarioWare style of game. Just d leave the part out where you're playing old games. It's like, I get- we get it. But just give us more of this over and over again. And put them in a shuffle and I, w I will play the living crap out of it. I've unlocked the remix too. There's a lot to see here. the shroom there. Ooh, this is gonna be... No. Oh, no. Anytime it's Princess Toadstool, I gotta almost say Peach! I'm just not used to her mechanics. How her levitation works, like, you can't just trigger it mid-air. It's gotta be something that you start with it. Oh, this- this won't matter to me at all. Okay, maybe it does. A little bit. Bring him here. Once I have this, that's it. Doesn't matter. Is 
Save Mario from the clutches of Donkey Kong. Oh, it's a roller vessel? Oh no, it's Luigi. We're playing as Big Weege. I, yep. I, I regret everything. I just realized the score's inverted as well. Yeah, I didn't I didn't do well on that one. I will I will admit that. Defeat Birdo? Oh, versus Dr. Meru. Let's see who's the better physician. It refuses to give me red. Alright, that was a red. Okay, I'm stretched. Just was not paying attention to what the other player was doing. I was just in the zone. Probably not that well, though. Yeah, average. I'm sure there's a better way to play it. Get to the goal pole, another darkness stage. No, it's reversed, okay. Because we're playing as Ouija, that's why. I'm playing a little more cautious because muscle memory is like non existent here. What am I doing? I <laughs> just need to get to the finish line. No warp pipe, just. Straight out. Okay.
automatic turbo. No, come on. I've done poorly. Yeah. <laughs> That's not easy. I have to pretty much get all these. Or it overheats and then I'm screwed. You can't crash, can you? Like, I have to not crash. This almost feels like I'm playing Battletoads. Oh, yeah, you, you can't. <laughs> you can't mess up. <laughs> that theme. I do love me some Zelda too. But like, after Hobbabat's, um... Enhanced version, let's call it. It's very hard to go back to the original. Like, I feel like I'm spoiled. Oh, it's Ouija time. Oh, I have, I have ruined it. Stupid fire. No! Ugh, damn it. I hate I hate the jumping in Donkey Kong. I've just never been good at it. Cause you have to come you have to come to sort of like a, a stop to do it. I just have to be more patient. Oh, I got it. <laughs> On second thought, back to the start. What is this? Oh, no. 
Yeah, that's not a position I want to be in. Shit. There we go. Good. One star. Okay. We got so much to do here. Get to the goal pole. Oh, oh my god. It's this stage, but on ice. Mario won ice physics. <laughs> they are way over the top. Wait, oh, this is so hard to control. No, just go. This is the last cause. Like, I, I don't have any traction whatsoever. No, it, these are not correct ice physics. They're, they are super exaggerated. It's like, I'm sorry, I keep momentum after I hit a wall, really? And the moment I jump up... Oh, it's like ice skating, so... Alright, it's not ice physics, it's ice skating, so you're always moving, no matter what. <laughs> okay, it's, it's not quite... It's not what I thought it was. Like, I don't even have to hold run. It's doing it for me. I can't go down the pipe either, I tried. I was trying to get a snipe on it as well, but it's just too hard. Oh! No, I'm going for the kill. Had to try. It would make this challenge trivial if that thing was dead. Yeah, that was, uh... <laughs> that was a tricky one. One star. Three star, apparently. Okay. Oh, it's... Yeah, okay. Oh. No, 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 but it doesn't matter. Okay. It works. Get to the exit without being hit. Oh, I can't float or swallow. There's no, uh, yeah. Suction of enemies. Oh, come on. I'm 
Just getting hit by random junk. I hate this. <laughs> I hate having to wait so long. Okay. Okay. Oh, that was not fair. It slowed down. Slowdown was real. Oh, I can't even touch the cannon. Okay. It's the umbrella that's killing me. Okay. This is this is kind of uh yeah <laughs> in the flame. Wow. I can't just run past it. Eh. 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 Yes. <laughs> Good stuff. So much stuff unlocked. Get to the goal pole, alright. What is the gimmick? Yeah! Hey! 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 Okay. I thought it was on kill, but it's just flashing lights in general. Solid performance, I guess. Another curvy one. No way, it's it's toad. <laughs> what? Oh no, it's <laughs> Pick up I can't pick up locks. That was weird. <laughs> but okay, I got it. Okay, down to two more. What is this one? Get to the goal pole. Oh, jeez. Okay. That... <laughs> I was like, this red gradient of the background is a bit ominous. Okay, so I can't do what I usually do on the stage, is just run through it. Because that... Bonsai Bill, I think, is its name. Ah! 
Yeah. <laughs> oh, you can't even bounce off it. Ooh, okay. That's a little disappointing. I wonder if it's always at fixed locations. Like here it's gonna... That is... <laughs> I don't think it's a fixed time thing, I'm almost positive it's fixed location. Yeah, it would seem so. Oh. I wonder if I can... Nope, it's just insta-death. <laughs> okay. And it doesn't matter if I'm big or small. I'd rather be small. Damn it. This, this one sucks. Oh, okay. Ah, But... I hate stopping because then... That's not how I play the game, it's just... I don't have the muscle memory anymore. Come on! Oh, this is annoying. Part here is the worst. Okay, there we go. Wait for it. I don't know where it's appearing next. Ah, <laughs> uh, okay. I gotta stop doing that. <laughs> I just gotta. No matter how much I want to play it this way, I won't be able to. Like, from this point, this is where I have to just watch myself a bit more. <sighs> really messes up with trajectory. No touchy. Come on. Ah. Oh no, no, jump too early. <sighs> okay, okay, this is the one. This is the one. Shot it.
Damn it. <laughs> I hesitated. That probably would have been it. I just needed to make that jump. just messes me up so much because the jumping in this, if you stop, it just becomes a little clunky. Hmm, probably gonna need a hit here. No, okay, we're okay. Go low. Ah, thank you. <laughs> You know, I've never played that properly. I've checked it out out of mild interest, but never actually played through it. Okay, final stage in the Remix 1 series. Oh, I hate this. This is gonna- this is gonna be some patience right here. What? What is that threading of the needle? Ah, oh, okay, got it. <laughs> Collect ten coins. Wind? Or is it just super fast? Okay, that wasn't a challenge. Take a shortcut. Oh. What do you mean, take a shortcut? Nope, that's... N I don't get what it means by take a shortcut. Just that? Okay. What's it gonna do to me? Or is this? Oh no, no, it's an auto. It's an auto runner. Okay, I, I don't have control over the run. Let's just jump. Okay. I just realized what it was when I tried to adjust my trajectory. I gotta watch for the head knock. There we go. Ignore- Oh, not the- I- I hate- I hate clone ones. This is my least favorite. <laughs> Yes, glitch passive for the win. <laughs> I totally clip. <laughs> ah. My character was in the wall for a second and I climbed back up. All right, cool. Well, that, yeah, that's 
all the unlocks from Remix 1 done. I'm having a lot of fun with this, so let's do a part 2 of this next week, I think. Well, you know, on the Saturday time slot before I go off and have dinner and do the, uh, the full stream. Anyway, yeah, I'm gonna wrap things up here on YouTube for now, but I hope you did enjoy the stream today. This is a fun little game. Definitely enjoying it, and I'm gonna do a bit more of it, but next time. Uh, and if you enjoyed it too, let me know. Leave a comment or do the like thing, because it lets me know to do more of it, but also helps with all that fun algorithm stuff. Uh, anyway. I'm gonna go take a break for a while, go get some food in me, and then we'll be doing Wind Waker and uh, more Kirby over on Twitch later. But otherwise, yeah, take care of yourself. And I'll hopefully see you next time here. Alright, later.